Yes, I am not making this up. This is real. <laughs> you can do this on any copy of Pokemon Yellow. You can do it on an emulator, you can do it at home on your Game Boy cartridge, and you can even do it on the 3DS. So, um, it does take a little bit of time to do, but it is really cool once you do it. So just follow these instructions, and you can get yourself to Logan Ninetales, and if not, just have fun watching. Thanks. So we're going to need a few things. Um, first off is a Pokemon with Fly. You're going to need to be up to at least Cinnabar Island at this point. And you're going to need a Pokemon with a stat, a uh, special stat, I mean, of exactly 192. And if you have a hard time getting to this, I suggest that you encounter a missing no. And then you will be able to uh, multiply whatever item is in your sixth slot by, like, a lot. So, <laughs> rare candies and calciums can be very helpful in getting the kind of special stat that you want to achieve. You're also going to need nine tails. Nine tails is a little bit hard to get in yellow, but it's not impossible. Um, you can get a Vulpix from the Celadon game corner, but um, it's a lot easier to just glitch one into your game. If you repeat the same glitch I'm about to show you with a special stat of 83, you can just glitch a Nine Tails into your game. That's how I got mine. Um, don't do Vulpix if you want an Alola Nine Tails because once you evolve it, it's going to lose the color. So keep that in mind. Then you're going to want an Ice type Pokemon. I chose Lapras because I like the coloring and the stats. It also has a really good move pool for the Alola Ninetales, and you're going to want to make sure that it has the same moves that you want the Ninetales to have. Don't use Cloyster for this, because Cloyster is like a really gross like brown in this game. But if you want to use like Articuno or Dugong, the coloring is a little different, but not bad for this. Um, still recommend Lapras. But then you also just need a garbage Pokemon. Because it is going to get turned into glitch garbage. So I started in Saffron City. Um, if you've ever done the Mew glitch, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, but if you haven't, um, just use this trainer here on the right side of Saffron City. And we're going to stand right in front of this door without battling him. Next, we're going to press down really fast, and then press start, like immediately after we press it. Um, I recommend that you save beforehand. Um, it's just a lot easier that way. And then your start menu will pop up instead of him challenging you. Now fly away to a town with a trainer that you haven't battled yet. And he sees you, but you fly away. So you really can run from a trainer battle. It is true. This Lavender Town like color scheme always reminded me of like Lean and like those like Xanax memes. <laughs> Or like that, what's that one like cup? That like blue and like fuchsia cup, I don't know. Alright, well, here's a trainer I haven't battled. Do not um, step directly in front of them. Make sure you have at least one space between you so they have room to walk up from you. Otherwise, um, the music will just start looping and you can't really do anything. Unfortunately, you have to start over. So I'm just going to speed this battle up because it's not really important. So after, did I just get $420? Alright, blaze it. Okay. <laughs> so, we're gonna fly to um, Cinnabar Island here. And unfortunately, Cinnabar Island is the only place in yellow where you can encounter a ditto. You can get them um, by Fuchsia City in red and blue, but no, nope, you just get screwed over in yellow on ditto, so. And you're going to go to the very bottom floor. If you don't know how to get there, just kind of watch what I'm doing. I should have brought repels. If I knew I was making a video. Who wouldn't want to press a secret switch? I know I would. And we're gonna just fall into the abyss and not have a concussion and just be walking around completely fine afterwards. Alright. And then the staircase will take us to the Staircase will take us to the very bottom, and here, I'm just gonna speed this up, try and find a ditto. Ditto is a pretty low encounter rate, unfortunately. Alright, so I just skipped to finding the ditto, because it's kind of time consuming. 
Um, make sure you don't attack the ditto on the first turn, so just move a, use a move like agility or switch something else into it. Or play your pokey flute. I like to play my pokey flute. Let's just play the pokey flute once. It'll wake your- not rare candy. Go away, oh, okay. Okay. That is a catchy tune. That is possibly my favorite- favorite thing that I'm just gonna speak this up. I'm sorry, it's really late. It's like midnight, which is actually not really late for me, but I'm still acting kind of weird. Okay, escape rope. Escape out of here. And we want to fly back to the town where the old man was, and I, um, I actually, while I was button mashing, caught a Grimer and eradicate by accident, so that was pretty interesting. <laughs> I didn't have either of them in my Pokedex, so I guess my efforts were not completely in vain. Um, we're gonna go ahead and just deposit some stuff real quick, because I only want to have my Sandshrew, my um, Ninetales, and my Lapras, which I want to share characteristics with my Ninetales. So we're gonna deposit Articuno. Did I just say Sandslash? I guess I could have used either of these as my garbage Pokemon, but that's fine. Okay. So we are going to walk towards the old man where we ran away from him. And our star menu is going to pop up. Why? Why? Oh my god, I actually was not expecting that. <laughs> okay. Alright, and um, this is not... <laughs> I'm sorry. This is not a missing no. This is a 44HY, which is a hybrid glitch Pokemon. Which means that it is part garbage data, and the other part of it is actually Slowbro. So it'll have Slowbro's coloring. Slow Bros moves and Slow Bros number in the Pokedex. Alright. So, we have 44HY. 44HY is pretty awesome. It plays the Vermilion theme song. This is Cry. And even if I just want to walk around the map, it still plays it. But that's not the point of the glitch. We, we are actually going to get a little in detail, so. 44HY evolves at level 6, but since we have a level 7 one, it'll evolve right away, and I'll learn a glitch move. Now this is going to be exciting. Never seen an evolution sequence like this, I bet. There you go, TM55, which is the name of our cube. And no, catching this Pokemon will not harm your game. Um, it does have some weird properties. It likes to hide. So, but it's, he's there. He is there. He has his slow bro moves. Um, and he is just great. So we are going to want to have our Pokemon in a very specific order. We're going to want Sandshrew at the top, or whatever Pokemon you're using is garbage. Um, we want Q to be in the second slot. And then we want um, Ninetales to be in the third, and Lapras at the bottom. Now I suggest switching your PC box to an empty one, because um, since Q- how, how this glitch works is that Q forces half of a Pokemon's data to move upwards in the party list. So if you pull it out in the middle of a box, half your Pokemon are gonna be messed up and turn into cues, and you're just not gonna want that. Um, I have made mistakes with Q before, it's not a big deal, just like reset your game, but... Not box three. Yes, it is okay. I consent. Alright, and we're going to deposit Sandshrew. Alright. So we have TM55. We have this. 
it will multiply itself. That is normal. We will have this. Bingo! Has ice moves. And I know you're gonna say, oh, well, it just looks like a, a regular Ninetales, and his name is Lapras. Well, that's normal. That's fine and dandy. Um, but you can just go rename it. And it will just be a Ninetales again. So let's take this thing into battle. And make sure you deposit all your cues into that safe box. And there it is. The Alolan Ninetales. So, uh, damn it, pass. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let me know if you want to see other, um, Pokemon like Alola forms or Shinies or something. Um, or if you want to see more glitch videos, I'd be happy to show you guys. But, hope you enjoyed. Thanks guys, have a great one.